Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I know this series is mainly for those data nerds like myself. Although sometimes, when you least expect it, something crazy happens with the RNG. I haven't opened 5 star shards in what feels like forever, but I got a 5 star champion a couple weeks ago for the first time in 2021. I haven't opened a uh, fully formed tier 5 basic in 2021, and I haven't opened a uh, single 10,000 shard batch ever. I've opened more tier 5 class catalyst fragments than I have uh, 6 star shards, which seems impossible. And yet, that is the case. But as always, believe it or not, the worst thing you can do in these is half of a tier 4 basic. And I always need more tier 4 basic. I just do. You can never have too many. You can never have too many tier 4 basic or tier 1 alpha. And if you are somebody who's looking to, to rank up a 5 star, and most people are, you can easily go from having maxed out, even with the Black ISO store inventory cap expansions, uh, maxed out tier 2 alpha to be in half of those gone, having 10 out of 20, because it takes 10 tier 2 alpha to take a 5 star from rank 3 to rank 5. Same with tier 1 alphas especially, you can lose so many of those so fast, but hey, it has been a long time since I have landed on that. Sometimes a crystal opening starts out great. And for me, that is great. That is a great sign. I, uh, I usually am lucky to get 9,000 tier 2 alpha catalyst fragments, which is the minimum. The second best is 18,000. And then the best is what I landed on, which is a fully formed tier 2 alpha. The rest of these six crystals can be average trash, and I'm pleased. I also like to compete with my man Danger Darren when he's not accidentally popping batches of one daily crystal when he claims them. It happens to everybody. But uh, that's, a, that's a big way to start. Probably tier 4 basic now, right? No! Tier 5 basic callus fragments. 4,500. As far as I can tell, it's either 4,500 or 45,000. Because that's how much it takes to do a fully formed tier 5 basic. Here I was thinking I'd... Hope for a fully formed tier 5 basic, and I got a fully formed tier 2 alpha instead. No tier 4 class catalyst fragments yet. Those are probably coming. No tier 4 basic. Those are definitely coming. I don't think I've ever opened a batch of 7 without getting at least uh, the worst once. But the tier 2 alpha, those things, to me, they're like, they're beautiful. <laughs> it sounds so twisted when you talk about it. It's a mobile game. There's Double Dad Bod, by the way. He's always haunting me in these things. And double Ant-Man, and there is the aforementioned, can never leave home without it, tier 4 basic. And so what that normally means is we need to uh, fast tap the next one and see if we can change our RNG luck. And we fast tap the next one, and there's the tier 2 alpha. Is it going to be 9,000 or 18,000? Probably 9,000. Yeah. See, that's normal. When you get a fully formed, that's like... Four and one, and I formed uh, another one, which means technically, I guess, I have uh, two. Well, let's uh, fast tap this one again, because it worked last time. There's the tier five class catalyst fragments I've only acquired once, and there is 4,500 more tier five basic catalyst fragments. Loved it, up to 9,000. I remind you, if you were not playing the game when it first premiered, in the unit store, it was $100 for 4,500 tier 5 basic catalyst fragments 4500 the same that i just got not once but twice for free as a throne breaker i got uh the price tag of a hundred dollars a piece for back in the day god regardian is in this way more than he's ever in the uh dual class crystals or five star basic and there is our first tier four uh class catalyst crystals of the day good news is we are uh, going to be able to keep this at about five minutes, which is always my goal, especially when it's just mainly for data, though when you get a fully formed tier 2 alpha, it's a little bit more than data, at least to me. I'm curious how many of those I have now. I just took uh, five star to rank five, shout out Immortal Abomination and all the people that encouraged me to make that rank up. Really appreciate it, as you all often teach me, often teach me far more about the game than I feel like I teach you. But uh, here we go. Us Crystal is 7. They've been a roaring success. There's the dad bod again. And we are ending tier 4 next to tier 5. Both tech. That's fascinating. Okay, so tier 4 tech. And was that the second one we got? That's fascinating. Well, there's the fully formed. 
And then we got past the 36,000. We are uh, making our way to the next tier five. And then we got the tier four science and the tier four tech, which by the way, I am tempted to rank up Ultron now just for fun because I like his buff a lot. But uh, in the inventory, thanks to those two, one fully formed, one formed with shards, back up to 18. That is certifiably nuts. I was down to two a few weeks ago. And then tier five basic, still at eight. Wow. All right. Well, thanks for watching YouTube. This was a lot of fun. A great opportunity for some data. And I always appreciate uh, the, the chance to open some more crystals. This is why you want to become Thronebreaker, to get these daily crystals. They're truly incredible. Now, I just wish uh, Kabam would give us access to the daily crystal when we were logged in the game for the daily calendar so that we'd get 365 daily crystals a year instead of like 340 or 330 or how many ever I get by the time I remember to claim them. Anyhow, rant over. Thanks for watching.